Growers, Wayne here, and it is Easter Sunday. It's about quarter after 5 p.m., and I decided to head offshore last second, do a couple hours of trolling, and see what I can get. So, four rod spread, mahi are around, but the wind was blowing out of the west yesterday, so that usually pushes them offshore, but let's see what we can do. Tight lines. So what I, got, what I do, guys, because I have a, a small boat uh, with no outriggers, so I actually use out rodders and I forgot them, so it's gonna make it even harder. I'm still gonna fish a four rod spread. I'm gonna show you how I do that on a small boat. So I like using, we're going for mahi, so we're gonna mix it up with pink feather, green feather, uh, zookers, um, and some uh, ballyhoo. So I'm gonna show you what I do. Using TLD 25s and one small feather which I put right behind a boat. So I actually clipped the loop off the pre the pre-made ballyhoo. So I could put a lure over the top of it and slide it on. These are some custom trolling lures from Hanu Lures. I'll put the link in the description. I won these from the fishing tournament that I placed third in. So I'll give him a little shout out. He did some great, great giveaways for that tournament. So I'll tell you what, we'll go with uh, trying his out today. These are the Zookers, which you can get at Bass Pro. And these are his custom lures. So I want to throw those over top of the Ballyhoo and uh, see what we can get. These are my favorite colors when trolling for uh, either mahi, blackfin tuna. I love the green and yellow to mirror the mahi color. I also love the uh, blue and white, and I also love pink. Those are my three favorite colors. Hmm. Having trouble getting in the hole. There we go. Slide down. That gives you the weight you need. Troll a little faster. Lengthens the bait. Gives it that color. Another thing, guys, is when you're using swivels trolling, do not use barrel swivels. Use ball bearing swivels. And it avoids all line twists of the ball bearing swivel. Change that up, guys. I decided to throw the daisy chain out there as a shotgun. All right. Another thing I do, guys, is I pull an umbrella rig off my downrigger, my electric downrigger, with uh, flashers on there some weighted squids to bring the fish up. And that looks awesome in the water. You can see that. So four rod spread, I got one over here, ballyhoo, with the blue and white over it. Over here, got the green and white over that. Usually I got my outriders to spread these rods out more, but I forgot them, so I'm gonna have to do it. I got a little pink, uh, little pink feather right behind 
my umbrella rig, which is about 20 feet back, just for something to buy that and be able to look at it. And as you can see, I got the clip down here so it stays low to the water. It doesn't skip out because it's so close to the boat. And then I got the shotgun way out the back with the gate chain. Let's see what happens. Dijon Mahi! Mahi on! Mahi on the short line, on the flat line! We'll leave it in gear to try and hook more. The pink feather, baby! we go, baby! Woo! Bloody! Beautiful. That's what I'm talking about right there. All right, spread is back out, and I'm gonna head right over the same spot that we hit that first one. I obviously went over a school because both Ballyhoo were mangled. Didn't get the hook set on either of those, but luckily one hit that uh, little feather and we were able to get one on that pass, so gonna hit that same spot. So I've been trying about two hours now and uh, only got the one. So no more action, but hey, that's better than nothing. And it's the end of a beautiful Easter day. There is absolutely no boats on the water but me out here. Uh, heading back in now and probably about seven miles out from the inlet. And uh, just taking it all in right now. I mean, gorgeous sunset. It's beautiful out here. So thank you for watching. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe. Got a lot of action coming for you. Hopefully gonna do a lot of fishing for about the next six weeks before I have my surgery, then I'll be down for a few months, but I'll try to get in as much action as possible. I greatly appreciate you watching. Tight lines.